hello friends so today we will see how we can share our uh, internet in our laptop with our BeagleBone ok so normally we will connect our BeagleBone using a USB cable and if we have internet in the laptop in our laptop then how can we share this internet into our BeagleBone so I am starting Putty uh, to check whether uh, this BeagleBone is having the internet connection. So I am logging using 192.168.7.2 which is the default uh, IP address allocated to the BeagleBone device. So I am uh, logging using the default credentials which is Debian and the password is tempwd. Yeah, now it is open. Now I can just uh, uh, ping uh, the uh, Google uh, IP address so that we can just verify if uh, internet connection is there or not. So it is showing network is unreachable. Okay. So what I should do next? First of all, we have to find out what is the IP address of our laptop. So for that open the command prompt and type ipconfig so it will show a lot of uh, IP addresses in different different sections so as you can see here you can uh, find wireless LAN Ethernet adapter VMware and wireless LAN adapter Wi-Fi but here uh, we need Ethernet adapter Ethernet 4 so I will explain that how uh, I, uh, I find out that one so here just uh, note down this IPv4 address here which is 192.168.7.1 Okay, now uh, you can go to internet settings window so just click there and uh, click on change adapter options so here you can find several icons uh, I'm getting the internet from my mobile phone over uh, Wi-Fi connection using its hotspot. So here, this is my Wi-Fi source. Sorry, internet source. So just right-click on this and click on properties. Then go to sharing tab. Then just share this. Just click on these two uh, buttons. Then press OK. So it is asking for selecting the connection. So here as you can see there are uh, several icons and here these cross marks are there means these are all not enabled or we are not using that. But these 1, 2, 3, 4, 4 icons you can see all are enabled but if you can uh, observe closely here it is written remote NDIA compatible device and here it is VirtualBox, VMware and again VMware. So these are all for virtual machines but uh, this is the one which we are using this Ethernet 4 this is the one which we are using for BeagleBone so this Ethernet 4 which we have to select then click OK so we have uh, configured the sharing option now just right click on this Ethernet 4 then click on properties now we have to assign a static IP address to our vehicle phone so just click on this IPv4 option and here you can see there are uh, two options here obtain an IP address automatically means our DHCP server will assign an IP address to this device so we should not allow that we can use a static IP address and earlier uh, from the command prompt we have found out this IP address so you can just uh, put the same IP address here now uh, we can uh, uh, provide the common DNS, DNS server like 8.8.8 now just click ok one more time ok so now again you uh, launch putty So we can open the BeagleBone connection. So type the username and password. Yeah. 
now we can check whether the uh, connection is established or not so for that again i am trying with uh, google ip address 64.233.169.104 still the network is not reachable so in order to achieve the internet connection we have to do one more thing just type sudo sbin root add default gw and then our laptop's ip address so we are setting the default gateway address and we are routing to our laptop yeah again we have to write the password now it is fine again we will check if the network connection is achieved or not correct yes so now we are able to ping so that's it guys so now onwards we will be posting similar kind of videos which will be useful for uh, uh, different activities like embedded system development software development and also we will be posting some kinds of uh, programming related queries bug solving etc so please be tuned and kindly like share and subscribe this channel bye bye